boys and girls, here's the activity for today. Okay, and you're gonna see that it says word pattern shh, just like Shane, he likes things very quiet. So let's say that SH again together. Shh. Now I want you to take a look at this top row of words. Okay, and this is to highlight the digraph shh. Digraph just means two letters that go together and they say one sound. So SH together again says what, friends? Shh, that's right, okay? So what I'm gonna do is for my first word, I see SH right away at the beginning. I'm gonna highlight over the shh. So let's try to sound it out, get your finger ready. Sh, uh, t, sh, uh, t. Okay, very good. Now, take a look at the next word. I don't even know what it is, but I'm already going to highlight the sh in it. Okay, so get ready, get your finger ready. Sh, in, sh, in. Nice job. Now, take a look at the next word. Just find the SH. This time, I see SH at the end. So, in looking at our words, I think SH could be at the beginning, like in sh, at, sh, in, but it also can be at the end. But I still want to start with the first letter in my word. So, get your finger ready. Sound it out with me. Ish. F ish. Okay, now get your highlighter or marker ready. You can circle it or highlight it again, and I'm still going to find the sh first. Okay, I know the sh together says sh. Okay, all right, so now this time you're going to do it with me. D a sh. D, A, SH. Nice job. Okay, go ahead and highlight the next SH. Where is it in the word? Is it at the beginning or the end? Yes, it's at the end. Okay, get your finger ready. We always start with the first letter. U, A, SH. U, A, SH. Nice job. Okay, highlight again the next SH in the word, okay? All right, get ready to say it with me. Get your finger ready. Sh, e, d, sh, e, d. Nice job. Okay, now we're on to the last set of words. Highlight the SH in the word, but this time I'm not gonna say it with you. I'm just gonna point to the letters and you say it. One more time. Nice. Did you say cash? That's right. Okay. Now, take a look at this middle word. I went ahead and highlighted the SH again, but I want you to take a look at C and K together. I'm going to underline it. Now, just in case you didn't know, C and K, just like SH, says one sound together. It just says k, okay? Do it with me, k, nice, okay? So now it's your turn. Get your finger ready, but you're gonna say it, not Miss Lucko. K, what word did you say? Yeah, I said that too in my head. Shock, shock. Okay, last one. Highlight the SH. Where's it at in the word? Is it at the beginning or the end? Yes, it's at the end. Good job. Okay, get your finger ready. You say it, not me. Hey, what word did you say? Dish. Nice job. So now, friends, find three of your favorite colors. 
I'm going to use green, blue, and purple. This time, we're going to rainbow trace the sh words, okay? So, start with the first word with me. I'm going to use green. You can use green or a different color. I'm going to trace over the F. What's F say? Nice job. Now, I'm going to use my blue. I'm going to do the I. What's I say? Eh. Nice job. Okay, now S and H is going to be one color. I'm going to put them both purple, okay? So, that says what? Shh. Good job. Let's sound it out. <sighs> eh. Shh. Nice job. <sighs> eh. Shh. Good job. Now, get your green ready again or whatever color you started with on fish. And what color are you going to do the S? Yes, do it green, but does the H go with the S? Yes, it does. What sound does it say again, friends? Shh, good job. Now, I use blue for my next color. I'm gonna do blue over the U. What sound does U say? Ah, uh, nice job. Okay, and purple for my last sound, and it's a T. What does T say? Good job. Okay, do it with me. Shh. Uh. T. Shh. Uh. T. What word did you say? Blend it. Shut. Nice job. Okay, get your green ready or whatever color you started with. Gonna do the L. Say it in your head. Good. Okay. Now, get your blue ready. What letter's that? A, good, what does A say? Say it in your head. Good. And then, S and H, does that go together? Yes, it goes together. Go ahead and trace over S and H in purple. What's S and H say? Say it in your head. Okay, now your turn, try it with me. Ooh, ah. Do it with me. Ooh. Ah. Shh. Blend it together. Ooh. Lash. Lash. Nice job. Okay, go ahead and start with your green or whatever color again. This time, I'm not going to tell you what to do because you are already an expert. You know what to do. And as I am writing over it, I'm saying the sounds in my head. Okay, now that you're ready and with me, get your finger ready. Say it with me, but actually I'm not gonna say it out loud. You say it. One more time. Hey, okay, this time blend it out loud with me. D-ish. D-ish. Dish, nice job. Let's see if we can say those words one time, right out loud. See if you remember the word. Start, remember that first letter. Fish, nice. Shut, good job. Ooh. Ash, good. And the last one, D ish, dish, nice job. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use kind of what we were doing before. We're gonna use our picture, but we have to find the word that goes in the sentence. So look at the picture, okay? I'm seeing a fish, and he looks like he's in one of those water bowls, okay? So let's read the sentence. The blank swims. Ooh, one more time. The blank swims. Ooh, cross-check with your picture. What swims? Did you say fish? That's right. I'll give you a hint, boys and girls. One of these words that we did the rainbow trace over, that has the word fish in it, okay? 
So I see my picture fish, and I'm sounding it out in my head. Fish. Fish. Now look through these words. What has that first sound of like in fish? Because I got a cross check. Cross check. I'm doing each one. What do you think? What's it start with? Yeah, I think it starts with the Let's sound it out. Let's sound it out. Ish. Okay, now grab your favorite color. You can use one of the colors you did over here, or you can use a different color. I'm gonna use green for this one. Okay, and I'm gonna cross check again. Ish. What two letters say? Sh. Yes, S and H. Okay, sound it out with me. Let's check. Ish. Ish. Nice job. Let's read the sentence. The fish swims. Is that what's in our picture? Yeah, the fish. Nice. Okay. Now, take a look at this next sentence. It's a little bit harder. Okay. I'm going to help you read it first. The bank has lots of blank. Ooh, look at our picture. What is that? Is that money? Yeah, that's money. Did we do any words up here that start with an M? No, we didn't. But what, what, what could be another word for money? And I'm gonna give you a hint, boys and girls, it's either this one, this one, or this one. Money is also, is it ash? Is it sh ok? Or is it d ish? Cash, shock, or dish? What's our picture? Yes, it's cash. Okay, go ahead and find a different color if you want or same color, your choice. So I'm gonna cross check. That's a C. A, that's an A. And then sh, what two letters say sh? Yes, S and H, okay? Let's sound it out. Ash. Is this a picture of cash? Yes. So what we're doing is we're doing a cross check. Look at the picture. Look at the first letter. Cross check with the word. Okay. Let's try to read the sentence one more time. I'll help you read it. The bank has lots of cash. Good job. Now, take a look at this picture right here, okay? This looks like a treasure chest, and it looks like a girl, and there's like some lines, and it looks like she's trying to do something with the lid of the chest, okay? So to try to get a better idea of what could be going on in the picture, I'm going to read it. The girl blank the lid. So the lid of the treasure chest, what do you think she's doing? Is she opening the lid or is she closing it or shutting it? Yes, she shut the lid. So here in our words, one of those words is shut. I hear a shh at the beginning. So let's Let's see, we already used fish. I don't think fish could be it. It could be this one, this one, or this one. Let's sound it out. Sh, uh, t. <gasps> shut, that's our word, shut. The girl shut the lid. Now I read it to myself because I wanted to make sure 
that it made sense because she could shut the lid to the treasure chest. Okay, go ahead and find your favorite marker and I'm gonna cross check. I'm hearing shh, oop, S-H, yep. And then shh, uh, yes, a U. And then what's the last letter? T, T, good job, okay? All right, this time I'm gonna to point to the to the parts of the word, you say it. One more time. Blend it. Shut. Good job. Let's read the sentence again. The girl shut the lid. Does our word match our picture? Picture of her with the lid. Shut. Shh. Yes, we cross check. Cross check with the picture, back to the word. Check them both. Nice job. All right, now the last part I'm gonna help start you on, but I'm not going to do it for you. This time you have to do the work, okay? So, but I will give you a hint, okay? First of all, let's talk about our picture. What is that? Yeah, that's a dog. What does the dog have? Did you say bowl? Or did you say dish? You know what? Bowl and dish, they're the same thing, okay? But let me think about it. The word bowl, b, o, l, bowl. Do you hear any sh in it? No, I don't hear a sh in it either. So now I'm gonna say the word dish. D, i, sh, dish. Ooh, I hear a sh there, okay? So let's read the sentence. The dog had a dish, okay? So we know our word is dish. And now here's my hint for you. Either this word or this word is dish, okay? So look at the letters, sound it out. Okay, let's do this word. Okay, you wanna put dish there. So with your favorite marker, I want you to write the word dish. So then when you go back and read it, it says the dog had a dish. And you cross check with the picture. Hopefully you got the same beginning sound with the picture, okay? All right, friends, great job. Keep it up, keep working hard, and I'll see you for next lesson.